because Ryan Naylor is here. We're on the Jobs Watch this morning. We're going to tell you where the hot jobs are in the valley. So we've got a hot company, Ryan. We do. Yeah, J.P. Morgan Chase, financial industry, obviously, bank, we've seen them all around. They are hiring for over 3,000 positions over the next couple of years, and they are growing like crazy. They just announced this campus in Tempe, and they're looking right now for over 100 positions. And so a couple of them that I, I wanted to highlight, some risk management, auto finance, they're really looking for some collections team uh, members to come in and be part of their collections call center okay. uh, here in the downtown area. But this company is growing like weeds in Arizona, and there's a reason why they chose Arizona. It's a great place to do business. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of opportunity for growth here. So we're really excited that they're investing that much into this big 67-acre campus. Where is this going? Is this Tempe. going down by a Tempe Town Lake? Where all, it seems farmers? like all the growth is happening yeah. down there. Yeah, it's exciting. It is exciting. When you uh, drive over that bridge, it's starting to look like a big city That's right. right along there. It's really cool. Okay, so our yeah. hot industry, which is? Manufacturing. So a lot of people forget about how powerful the manufacturing industry is. In fact, a few years ago, uh, the government spent almost $16 billion in contracts with manufacturing companies just here in Arizona. There's a lot of growth and opportunity. Your average income for some of these manufacturing jobs is $70,000 a year. That's twice the salary average of your normal job in Arizona. Is that something where you need a degree? A lot of them you don't. They're looking for industry experience or people willing to come in and kind of learn the ropes so and become very skilled trade. What are some of these companies creating? So a lot of these, uh, well, they're going to be any supporting government contracts okay. or aerospace industry. Um, it could be even technology manufacturing, so technical parts and, and that sort of thing. So there's a lot of growth in this manufacturing here in Arizona. So if people are looking at that transition, like, I need to get into something new, Jump into one of these. You don't need a degree, but you show that work ethic, yeah. and you can do pretty well you for can yourself. Pay out pretty nicely. That's right. Awesome. Okay, so we've got that interview. Yes. How are we gonna get that job? What kind of things do we need to do? And well, your first tip is be prepared. That's right. You're gonna have a lot of people, you know, just showing up to interviews. They get yeah. excited about it, and they forget to do the research on the company. Yeah. You've got to know the company, know the industry, and have those questions ready. Um, we see a lot of people in the interview just really hesitate when they say, now, what questions do you have for me? Yeah. You need to show you did your research and you're proactive. Is it, I like to keep a list. Is the cell phone okay? Whip out my cell phone. These are my questions I had Absolutely. for you. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Have a list ready to go and, and start pegging those questions okay. out. Uh, know as much about the company as we can. That's right. So yep. is that Google? Is that talking to people? You know, get on social media. Look mm -hmm. at what they're t talking about. Look at their company news. Uh, do a Google alert for their company name. And you can start to see a trend of what the conversation should look like. Mm -hmm. And what they're kind of talking about. OK, my favorite question. What are your strengths? What oh are your weaknesses? <laughs> that is so hard. And everyone hates talking about themselves. Yeah. But you need to know it. So they're going to say, what are your strengths? Mm -hmm. Be prepared to not only give an answer, but give an example of how you utilized that strength in your previous work okay. career. And a lot of times, that's when they start to visualize how your strengths can impact their company. So that track record. So you got to be ready for that awkward question. You know, what are you the best at? I mean, we. Yeah. It's just going to be awkward. Your but weakness is, be is ready. It too too obvious if you say, "I just am a workaholic. Yeah. I'm a perfectionist. I just work too hard. <laughs> I just love work." <laughs> <sighs> okay, that's great advice, that's right. and it's nice to hear we have some great manufacturing jobs, 75K, it's very, exciting. very cool, great opportunities. Yes. Brian, thank you. You're we'll welcome. We'll see you again soon. Thank you very much. All right.